What is up, Swarm? Corey here with Honeyland. Happy Friday. Uh, I've got a couple announcements for you as we head into the weekend. Uh, and then I'm actually going to be traveling the next two weeks. So uh, updates will be either a little bit more infrequent or will be from live locations. I'll be at GDC, the Game Developers Conference, next week. Hop on a plane on Friday. Uh, me and Justin will be out there all week. Uh, we've got some really cool stuff planned. We're headed to the Solana offices. They've got a headquarter in San Francisco. We've got some meetings there on Tuesday. I'll be speaking at a Solana event on uh, game design and economy design around uh, Web3 games. Uh, and then just a bunch of other really, really cool events and meetings. Uh, we are so pumped on this event. Uh, it's my third year in a row going to GDC and I am more excited than ever this year with everything we have planned. And then next week we'll be, or the following week I should say, uh, we'll be heading to New York City. We uh, will be part of the Solana Hacker House out there. Uh, again, just really cool event to be uh, just part of the Solana ecosystem and builder ecosystem, uh, get to meet a ton of other really cool founders, uh, get to share our project with tons and tons of people. There's just a lot of great networking, connections, events, and uh, the more we can be embedded in the Solana ecosystem, the happier we are and uh, obviously the better we are as a project. So some really cool stuff. Just know announcements will either be coming from different mediums or maybe on location, uh, but we will keep you posted with everything going on. All right, let's talk about today. So we have, uh, we just yesterday released a new uh, game update for Honeyland. Uh, when you go to log in, you'll be asked to go update that. So all of you, if you're uh, seeing this as like an in-game announcement, you've probably already updated. Let me share with you everything that you can expect in this new build. Um, so first off, we had a couple people report that they're having issues where the game's crashing on iPhone uh, on login. We are aware of this. This is kind of the one like known issue that we've had. Um, and then, uh, but everything else seems to be, people are just loving a lot of these new features. So feature number one, um, the, we've updated the referral system. And so previously we were having, uh, basically if you go to the bonus uh, where you get to your daily wheel spin, uh, click bonus, and then you'll see on the left-hand side, you'll see referrals. And then you have a referral link that you can share with anybody. And as you're sharing that link, when people are coming in and downloading and playing the game uh, and doing things in the game, you can actually start getting rewards uh, in the form of shards. And then we have like a, a monthly leaderboard where we've got some really, really cool prizes. So as you're referring more and more people and they're doing more things in Honeyland, you're getting rewarded regularly with just shards. And then you're also climbing up a leaderboard with some really, really cool prizes there. So refer people, help grow Honeyland, uh, get all your friends into the game. It makes it more fun for you and for them and helps grow the ecosystem. Um, so we've done that. But the update that we made is you have a referral link and sometimes if people were like sending the link out and somebody was downloading with a VPN or they were on a device that had previously install, installed or certain things like that, that uh, there were, they were just running into issues where it wasn't tracking that referral the way that it should. Uh, and so now you have that referral link, but if it doesn't track properly, it, you can also manually enter in a referral code. Now this is only for brand new accounts. So if you referred somebody two months ago, they didn't put you in as a referral, they can't unfortunately retroactively go back and plug in your code, but we're really trying to fix this system. Uh, we're gonna have some cool referral incentives uh, as we get into um, these coming months. We really want you guys to be incentivized and rewarded for helping to grow the Honeyland community. We'll make some more announcements um, in April with some plans that we have there. So uh, updated referral system. Thing number two, uh, if you stay in the uh, the bonus section, you'll notice that the last two days you've actually got a bonus spin, uh, which was uh, for Sabona, where you're actually getting HXD in that Sabona spin room. So every time Sabona has a game day, you'll see the welcome loading screen with the Sabona where you've seen a, a number of times We'll put an, a message in your inbox to let you know who they're playing and what type of the game is. And if there's a way that you can follow that in real time uh, or by video, we'll include all of that information. And then on those days, you'll be able to go into your bonus spin room and you'll get a Sabona spin before you get your normal daily spins. The Sabona spins are always gonna be for HXD. It's as little as 0.1 HXD. It's as much as 10 HXD on each spin. That'll be every single game day, you'll get one Sabona spin. If they win the game, you can come back the next day and get another Sabona spin. And so uh, you'll get two spins every time they win, uh, basically day, the day of the game and then the day after the game. If they don't win, unfortunately, you only get it the game day. But uh, hopefully we can all start rooting for Sabona. We can uh, really celebrate their wins knowing that there's an actual impact on everybody in the Honeyland community when Sabona plays and when Sabona wins. Uh, let's continue to drive that. Uh, relationship and partnership forward. We've got some other cool things that we'd love to, that we will be sharing with you on the horizon about Sabona as well. Um, you have the ability now, actually sticking in the, the bonus tab, you'll notice a new tab in there. So if you go to bonus, you're in that uh, wheel spin. On the left, you'll notice a tab now that says uh, social. 
It's down right now. Like as we speak, we're loading in some final like credentials, uh, but this will give you the ability to start go following uh, our Twitter account. It'll give you the ability to uh, link to our Discord if you're not already connected to our Discord. Um, and this is really laying the foundation for some much larger things that we'll be launching in the future. So the ability to, um, uh, uh, to, to create like shareable moments. So if you have your Twitter or your X account linked to your Honeyland account, when you like get a really cool hatch or you get a really cool reward from a hunt or you um, up, up to, grade from level, you know, 12 to level 13 in your XP, um, as you beat somebody in a PVP, like all these shareable achievements inside Honeyland will now be shareable with a single click on Twitter, a really cool way to spread the word for Honeyland. But also we see people taking screenshots already and then doing it manually. We just wanted to make this a lot easier. And then we'll also, as we have things that we want you to engage with, we can actually create these as XP tasks that we can say, hey, go like our tweet or retweet our tweet. Uh, and in doing so, you can actually collect and claim XP inside Honeyland. It'll help again, create a lot more organic virality uh, from our tweets and the engagement uh, that we're trying to get online. And so those are coming down the road. Uh, just understand that this is kind of just getting the foundation set, giving you the ability to go follow us. I would encourage you to do that. Uh, our Twitter and Discord are two really cool resources to stay up to date with community and announcements and kind of fun things that are taking place. All right. Um, the last thing is that you can now create bulk items in inventory. So if you go to your inventory, if you have like a thousand shards and you're like, I want to create 25 common upgrades or whatever it is, right? Uh, instead of having to do it 25 individual times, you can just click all the way up to 25 click go and we'll create, create 25 items at once. Uh, for those of you who are whales or have a lot of items, this is a very, very welcome uh, feature. In the future, we're working on um, egg creation that can be done in a much more efficient manner where we can actually pre-mint eggs uh, and we can allow you to create those in bulk for gen ones. Uh, I think gen twos and threes, you'll still have to manually do uh, one at a time, but we can have kind of the blockchain part taken care of ahead of time. Uh, one other uh, notable change in here is that Gen Z hunts will no longer uh, be bringing back in honeypots, the poison bombs, the cursed honey drops, the shields or the sonar buzz. Those are just items that have actual impact on not just the free to play economy, but also the, the, the real economy. And it was creating kind of an imbalance. Uh, and so those will not be findable in Gen Z honeypots anymore. However, we've increased the amount of uh, Gen Z eggs that you can find in honeypots and Gen Z mood stabilizers, which are probably more valuable items for those free to play players anyways. So we're giving you more of probably what is more useful and also protecting kind of the larger, um, uh, you know, web three um, economy that, that, that as well. Now, some people are like, well, I needed those shields so that I don't get attacked in PVP. Um, I'll just remind you, there's a lot of ways to get a field shield. Log in daily, free shield. As long as you continue a daily login streak beyond day seven uh, or beyond day six into day seven, every day you'll have a free shield. That's the easiest way, that's what I do. Second, you can just load in a defense team, right? Like you've got enough Gen Z bees, put three of those back as a defense team and um, they can always defend your hive as you get attacked and give you the ability to actually earn uh, and win PVP battles as well. Um, if you want those shield shards, you can get them through the shop. You can also get them through playing Bumble Bash, getting those keys. It's a really easy way to go get a lot of those kind of poison bombs and shields and some of those items that are a little bit more common, uh, but also have an impact on um, the, the, the web three economy, not just the free to play economy. So that's what I would say. Just know that those changes took place. Uh, the last final announcement is Honey Madness is coming up. This is like a contest that we do for our Genesis holders only, uh, but for uh, March Madness, it's like this, it's this basketball tournament inside uh, at the, in the United States, like a college basketball tournament um, and people fill out brackets. It's really fun. There's a lot of like hysteria here in the States. Uh, we do a free entry tournament. So if you're a Genesis holder, it doesn't matter if you hold one or 100, you'll get two entries into the tournament. They're absolutely free. They have really, really cool prizes. I think we pay out the top seven places. Uh, the first place prize will get a Genesis B egg, um, a Honeyland NFT, like a trophy that shows that you're the champion with an in-game badge and 3000 HXD. Um, beyond that, you can get like some Gen 1 Queen Eggs, Gen 2 Queen, egg, queen Eggs, some HXD. We pay out the top seven spots. Uh, your highest entry of the two will place you onto that leaderboard. Uh, so you can't win first and second place, you can win your highest place only. Um, if you want details on that, you'll have to be in our Discord. That's where all of this is gonna take place. So you need to be a Genesis holder. You need to be in our Discord if you want to get access to all that stuff. Uh, all right, that's all I got for you guys. Uh, have an awesome weekend. I will be at GDC next week. I'll give you guys all the updates. If you're gonna be in San Francisco for GDC uh, or in that area next week, if you're gonna be in New York City uh, for Hacker House or in New York City that week, let me know. I'd love to connect with you guys. That's all I got for you. I absolutely love you. Zub, zub.